Hello everyone. Today, we'll be talking about the applications of trigonometry in the real world. And my name is Dave Thacker. So introduction, what is trigonometry? Trigonometry is a field of mathematics that investigates the connections between the side lengths and angles of triangles. So basically, it's the relationships between lengths, angles, and circles. Now, although trigonometry is mainly a topic of math, it can also be used in other sciences, such as physics. In fact, trigonometry was first invented by a Greek mathematician named Hipparchus from 130 to 190 BC. He created a table of values for trigonometric functions, which is still in use today. Since he had a strong passion for astronomy, he had actually used trigonometry to make his calculations much easier by using methods to solve for spherical triangles using the table of values that he had constructed. Although Hipparchus had done all this work for society, modern and advanced technologies has actually allowed us to use trigonometry in the real world. Therefore, the construction industry, the creation of video games, and marine biology are perfect examples that show trigonometry in real life. So the construction industry, that should be something that's really important to us because those individuals that are working in this industry are the ones that are creating different buildings, bridges, and many more. A lot of these people are actually architects and civil engineers. And these people go to college for a really, really long time just so they get experienced and certified. Architects, they use the trigonometry to calculate structural load, maybe roof slopes, and also the placement of lengths that, that are used for supporting beams. So as you can see on the right, there's a photo that shows that. And another thing that they also do is finding out the angle the sun hits the structure. So um, in this case, this can be applied to the bridge that's shown on your left. So as you can see, um, there's some sort of sunlight coming on and the ar architects and civil engineers had made sure that there is a good amount of sunlight and not too much hitting the bridge. And additionally, we can also see that trigonometry was used to create circular shapes as well. So for example, in this bridge again, we can see the circle shape or an oval or a semicircle. And that was really good as well. And to also find the length and basis, we need to use trigonometric functions such as sine and cosine to find the height and distance of a building. And this uses the idea and concept of a right triangle. So therefore, we could see the importance of trigon trigonometry in the construction industry today. Now we'll be talking about the creation of video games. So I know a lot of you guys um, play video games. And the use of trigonometry is really important in game design because without this, you'll only be able to jump vertically. Now, thanks to Hipparchus, we have the ability to make characters jump parabolically. One great example for this is the game Super Mario Bros. So in Mario, you could see him effortly gliding over these different roadblocks, and he doesn't quite jump along the y-axis. He takes a slightly curved pathway to avoid the obstacles that are in his path. And Mario can actually overcome these hurdles thanks to trig trigonometry. In fact, the only reason that this occurs is because they're created by IT and computer science professionals. Now, when they are coding these games in the front end and back end, they have to be mindful that the character is not jumping up and down or along the y-axis and instead jumping parabolically, which is what we see in the majority of games today. So thank you for that. And now lastly, Marine biology has also played a major role in trigonometry today. To start, marine biology is a study of marine organisms in terms of their behavior and adaptations to their environment. Trigonometry can be used in this case to learn how high above insects are from ground level. Using trigonometry, we could use a right angle triangle to conclude the exact location of these different species. And another example can be for fishing, so when you're trying to find fish in the water. Now, when you're throwing the rod into the water, you need to know the right way to throw it. 
and it has to be at a slight angle so we can go straight onto the fish when you're in the water. As you can see from the photo, the different angles that each part of the rod are even at is really important. And also this somewhat involves the concepts of physics as well. So in conclusion, trigonometry can be used for countless different activities today. It has played a significant role in both academics and the real world. Its intricate applications in construction, video games, and marine biology has left us with a considerable amount of interest in learning about trigonometry. We first started off by learning about Hipparchus and his accomplishments in trigonometry. And now we're able to use everything that he's left for us into the real world and for us to actually benefit from it. So thank you everyone for listening to my video about the application of trigonometry in the real world. Have a great day.